and some of the intelligent assistant applications that they have going on. The conversation is going to look, look at uh, avatars and the kind of emotional engagement of, of intelligent assistants um, and AI uh, and beyond panel that's coming up later. Uh, this came up yesterday with, about customer data, customer control of that data, uh, and personalization. I think that's a topic that's threaded throughout a lot of these different sessions, and we're excited to, to, to hear that's, that'll be part of the focus of the, of the, of the final panel of the day. Um, and also, we're looking at the, uh, the, the integration of intelligent assistance within vertical opportunities um, specific to finance. We heard about healthcare yesterday as well. Um, we'll, well. We'll hear more about that today. And then, of course, we encourage everyone to, to network where where possible, we have a lunch plan for you today, as well as the other breaks. So, um, before I introduce Steve, just wanted we, again, like on the first night, we had a welcome reception that Agentbot had uh, 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 hosted, and wanted to do. It's okay, Dan. Um, uh, we, we did some interviews, talking about, kind of asking questions about what people want to learn about intelligent assistance, and um, here, here are some of the answers to that question on on Monday night. The major touch point for intelligent assistance from companies and customers is going to be in and around still customer service, but I think you'll start to see it move towards any type of transaction that can be automated. One thing that's very interesting is, is the trust factor, is, is that people and patients and individuals start to build relationships with intelligent virtual assistants. And you, you have to look at the psychology and the trust and, and building that, and then that ties back to the brand and the value there. Whether they want to ask on the mobile, on their phone, or on the desktop, uh, we utilize the uh, virtual agent uh, to facilitate that. My background is finance, so how does intelligent assistant help me uh, handle my customer with the same security, and how that fits into my security model.